Okay, we almost had them. Look, we have the we have the building blocks of the strategy here. We just need to put them together the right way. He's got spell sword throw. Do you have? Yeah, she has throw this time, which will help. No more fucking double slapping with those katanas. She's time white, and then she's white summon because we need a little damage. Ah, uh, oh, you get the shoes. Perfect. You've got the the good shoes. And she's got yeah the flame shield for fire. She can't wear a shield. But we've got the healing staff, which I really wish it would amplify your healing, but tier three is already a full heal for everybody. I think we don't have a fourth ribbon, which is a shame. Okay, white robe, a little extra magic power, not worth it. Okay, so safe shell. That was the trick. We just have to not. We can't have just one guy survive. I went back and I watched how I got the shit kicked out of me. He didn't freak out till he was the last one alive, so we just gotta get the one that was casting Almagest. And then we're fine. That really fucking hurt. Everything was going fine until that one guy was the last one alive. We just gotta watch the MP on Lennon Ferris. A little fast. Yeah, look at that. He hit like ours for 1300, then hit Lennon for 300 with save. Okay, then we gotta take it a little bit easy. We don't wanna get to that second phase before we're all buffed up. But, well, actually, it was, still, it was still pretty touch and go. Well, we didn't have throw. We didn't have throw. So if Krill can just impale the one casting Elm, I guess we're off to a great start. There's the safes. Alright, she's dead because she doesn't have shell. That's okay. Let's get a Phoenix down because we don't want to waste our MP this early. Well, I was just a little lucky for her. I think she shelled. Fuck her shell. You know, no, I want both back. We'll just drink an elixir when she gets low. This guy's tens of thousands of HP, so we have plenty of time to get buffed up. I really wish I could see what everybody's fucking buffs were. I'm just gonna have to reshell everybody just to be double safe. There's a very tiny chance Lena doesn't have shell with put on. Okay, we're good. I don't want to say golden, but we're not dead for a couple turns. Yeah, definitely want to save those pinwheels. So we'll just chip away at this stage. I'm, I'm loving this. I'm loving the basic attack. Appreciate it. Oh, the other trick I saw when I watched me get beat up last time is when he makes the screen shake, because that's when he does that on the guest. So that gives us some time to get a heal ready.
You know, I kind of want to just drink an elixir right now. I'll leave some ethers. Let's feed her an ether. I think I have a single ether, actually, that we found recently. No, we have seven. I think every time I comment on how many ethers I have, we might get beat up by a boss. And ran back and used a cabin. All right, we're, we're in a good spot here. Now not so much. That terrifies me. There we go. It's her turn. First things first. Just fucking throw a... Oh shit, which one was it though? <laughs> I don't remember which one in the middle was doing it. Well, we're going to be in for a treat if I don't kill the right one quick enough. Because that's the real problem, right? Is if, it's, if there's no Elma guess, we can handle everything else. The Grand Cross didn't hurt. Delta Attack didn't hurt. Okay, come on out, you little shit. There's four of you, there it is. I wanna I, I wanna say it's this guy. I wanna say it's the red unicorn thing. I think everybody's fast. Let's just see what he does. Okay. Oh shit, that's... he's gonna Alma guest. Get ready. I don't think I have enough health after that shit. One is turn two, though. I mean, you actually have a lot of time on the Elma Guest. Okay, you're just gonna have to eat that. There it is. Oh, never mind. That's only 700. Oops. That's. I think we're in good shape now. Now that we know the shaking, let's just know Elma Guest is coming. The laws of physics are broken. I. I can't remember what that means. That's not... That's not terrible, because she's got the most health. Get the fuck out of here. Kill them damage here, because we got to try to kill the last two at the same time. Or around the same time that they don't fucking send us to the meteor dimension. Which I think we can just do with Gil Toss and Summon. Um, he might not survive that, actually. Oh, close one. Oh, right, that's shit. So, oh, actually, he's gonna have a magic barrier on. That might actually come in handy if he has that the whole fucking fight. Oh, I should have gave him a heal. I should have gave him a cure three all himself. Come on. Still not fucking dead. I just need to hear that sound. I just need to hear the sound of the head dying. And then hope he doesn't cast down guess ever again and get the right head. Um, that might be bad news. 
kind of bad news. Uh, you know what? Just because we are getting a little low on MP. No need to take chances. Laws of physics are broken. Okay, that's a problem. Show yourself instantly. I am a little amazed how many pinwheels this has taken. Okay, okay, he's dead. Delta attack doesn't do anything. She doesn't have a ribbon. Okay, okay, he's gonna Elm, I guess. We're ready for it, though. Um, just in case she doesn't have it, we're going to put it back on. No, wait, if he's casting Elmagus, shit, I killed the wrong head. It's the other middle one. Okay, okay. That's not good. Fuck, this all help out too. No, 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 because that just gives you something to do on her turn. Oh, no. That was some incredible timing, homie. problem brewing here. These back-to-back -back turns are literally killing me. Okay, so it's that... I don't even know what that thing is. He's got a giant grin. He's the one casting Elma Gastonis. This is our last pinwheel. a full cure here because he's got 1800 health. The vacuum waves do suck. Okay, there's that holy spear. Just impale him. We're on Guild Toss Patrol now with your hope we don't run out of money. I need an elixir. By I, I need one. I guess I am all four people. Holy shit, that's a problem. That's a problem because I wanted to cast Bahamut there. Nobody died. Regen's not gonna really save us here. Well, I suppose I can help out a little bit. Okay, it's just two, it's just two. You're on Elixir Patrol. Throw some magical ninja scrolls in the meantime. Just as long as they don't freak the fuck out on us. They are, though. Well, not not really. I think it's the one in the front is the one that's punching us, and he punches for a lot. But it's better than Meteor Hell.
I guess the numbers might not work out, so one might die a little bit quicker, and then we gotta just blow the other one up as quick as we can. Perfect. He's got the most health. Well, actually, Krill is the most by 50, but he can take a flare on the chin. But the downside is when those guys get too low, they need a they need a cure three just for themselves. That's fine. Actually, that's not particularly fine. But we're gonna risk it. Probably a little ways off because their damage is a lot lower. Now that we can uh, throw things at a single target, oh boy. You will. No, no, we can get the Lena out. I hope. If Lena gets hit by anything, she's gonna die here. Oh shit, one died and the other didn't. Oh boy, which one is it? Which one lived? Doesn't matter. We're, we're, in, we're in meteor hell now. It's the one in the back again, motherfucker. This is bad. This is very bad. This is awful, we're right back where we were. Damage is a lot lower though, what the fuck? Ow. Oh fuck! Oh, thank god, Krill. Way to avenge your grandfather. Just kills Ars and then she just threw a dagger in his fucking throat. Look at that, and we learned from our mistakes and we overcame. I guess that's Final Fantasy V in a nutshell, really, but this is the hardest fight. So far, I mean, it's the final fight, so that's fair, but... Oh man, we almost got stuck in the meteor hell for a bit. In the beginning, there was void. Then four spirits came together in this void. The crystals were born, and the world was created. Thus, hope gives the earth blessings. Courage lights the flame. Kindness makes water the source of life, and passion lets wisdom ride the wind. When the day comes that the void shall again envelop the world, if within people live the four spirits, light shall again be born. Some weird looping on the text there, I think. But most of us survived is the important part. I guess we're all taking a nap. Ha! <sighs> Whoop! Get up! Ha! <sighs> Whoop! Come on! Ha! <sighs> Ooh. I guess we can fly now. The void hasn't disappeared. Even though we've defeated Xdath? Is it because the crystals are gone? 
Is the world going to be enveloped by the void? Ooh. Hope gives the earth blessings. Who? Courage lights the flame. Kindness makes water the source of life. Oh, I'm going the highest, apparently. And passion lets wisdom ride the wind. There's that wacky pyramid. I think that's where we found the tablet. Oh. Now, were those places there? Originally, or did these get sucked in from Gallus World? I guess maybe they pulled the crystals out of there and moved it to the temples with the Sid machines. I don't know how the fuck they grabbed this one, though. There's the ancient library back. Hopefully everybody's not dead. I think this one's my hometown. It is. This castle tycoon. We've done it. The world is being reborn. The crystals too. There was still some power left in the pieces of crystal. I'm so glad. I'm also glad those dozens of people didn't die. It's because Lena and Ferris and Krill. It's because you protected the crystal so well. Ars, you too. And Grandpa. Now the wind will return to Tycoon. Yes. Oh! Everybody's up in the sky like Star Wars. Father. Grandpa. Father. Father. And Kelgaren says it too. Hello. The world still needs you. It's still too early for you to come where we are. You've done well. Now, back to your world. Whoop. You know, I'm not sure which dragon survived. I don't know if it's Lena's dragon or Krill's dragon that died. I think it was Lena's dragon. It died to save her when uh, she joined our party back. Apparently I'm very sleepy. I did get killed. Here, hang on tight. Don't fall asleep. You won't be able to get out. Battle just drained my energy a bit too much. See ya. Where's this one? I don't know what that one is. Grandpa. A letter's arrived, even though we don't have a post office and it's just the two of us living here. To Sid. 123 Abandoned Ruin Avenue. Sid, mid, are you doing well? It's Lena. It looks like we've been saved.
Somehow, now it feels like that battle was all a dream. Guess we're just hanging out with the Mughals. Since then, I have traveled around to various towns. Things have returned to how they were before. It's so peaceful. Ha ha ha. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think I've worried the Chancellor too much. I'm going to spend more time in the castle from now on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But Ferris seems worried about the pirates. Oh. Ha. Just slips out through the solid window, why not? Castle Vall is having problems that there's no one to succeed the throne. Maybe even Queen Krill? <laughs> I mean, she did kill Ekstad. Probably deserve your own castle after that. The wind has returned to Tycoon, I'm sure, somewhere. Father's watching. Oh. 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 By the way, Boko and Coco have had children. They're so cute, you should come meet them. Hello. I guess they're waving to, to us. But the one Boko wants to show his healthy children the most to is probably ours. It's been one year since then. I'm planning to go to that place. The place where my friends sleep. If the others come asking you guys about me... No, I'm sure they'll come. Please tell them that I wanted to see them again. Huh. Where have you gone? Sid wasn't here for this. Ooh. I don't know if that turtle guy survived, actually. Sid definitely... These are just memories Sid couldn't have had, so I was just reminiscing about the times I wasn't here. Hup. That's where we sucker-punched Kelgar, which I think caused him to die of his injuries. Oh! That's where we found out Ferris was a lady. Hubba hubba. Arse. That's it? Those are the memories you guys have of me? Were you really swallowed into the void? Oh. Did you say something? I swear I heard something. It said, this place isn't for you to come yet. If, at that moment, if Galif had not saved me. 
The earth, wind, fire, and water are all alive, and the world has returned to peace, but I'm still sad a bit. I'm sure now. It's because Ars isn't here, isn't it? What? Gallif, did you say something? You're alive. I don't look alive. Oh. Didn't I tell you before? This place isn't for you yet. After the last battle with Extaff, I was so exhausted. I didn't have enough energy to escape the void. Everyone became smaller and smaller. I started to feel relaxed. Ah, but then I heard the voices of the Warriors of Dawn. This place isn't for you yet. The crystals have regained their power. Now we must protect it. Just like Dad and the rest had protected them. Hey, don't you hear something? Yeah, I hear it. Grandpa's voice? No. The rustling of the trees? The murmur of the water? The flaring of fire? The whisper of the earth? That, one, that last one's made up. I don't know. I don't know, but... I can hear it. Yes, something warm. Let's go. Okay. Ha. Very kind of you guys to bring me a chocobo just in case I came back to life. I appreciate it. Oh, we've done it. We beat Final Fantasy V. Director, Hironobu Sakaguchi. Image design, Yoshitaka Amano. Music composer, Nobuo Umatsu. Field plan, Yoshinori Katase, Ikuya Dobashi. Battle plan, Hiroki Yatoi, Akihiko Matsui. Field program, Ken Narita. Battle program, Kiyoshi Yoshi, Ketsu, Ketsuhisa Higuchi. Field Graphics, Tetsuya Takahashi, Hideo Manaba. Object Graphics, Kazuko Shibuya, Romi Ito. Battle Graphics, Masanori Hashino, Tetsuya Nomura. Battle Graphics, Hiroshi Takai, Hirokatsu Sasaki.
menu program, Shinichi Tanaka. Sound program, Minoru Akeo. Visual program, Keizo Kukubo. Map design, Kaori Tanaka, Yukiku Sasaki, Hidetoshi Kezuka. Sound effects, Kenji Ito, Yasunori Mitsuda, Yoshihiku Mikawa. Test assist, Akiyoshi Ota, Nobuyuki Ikeda, Mami Kawai. Executive producer, Tetsuo Mizuno and Hitoshi Takamura. Special thanks to Masafumi Miyamoto, Kazuhiku Turashima, Koichi Ishii, Takahashi Kohida. Oh, we don't have time to read those ones. Thanks, though, fellas. And don't forget these guys. Some more. A lot more, apparently. A lot more. Apparently it takes more than 20 people to make a Final Fantasy game. Need all these other fellas. And me, apparently. I didn't make the game, but thank you, Final Fantasy V. Oh, there's Krill. Oh, it's showing us her stats. Level 39, jobless. That sounds about right. Build up, mantra, smoke, image, throw, sword slap, guild toss, slash, brawl, counter, evade, alert. She only learned 15 job abilities, but I guess we really leaned on that slash and the, the dual wield, but most of the slash. The slash got us through a lot of fucking sticky pickles. And then it didn't help at all in the final boss, so she just started throwing shit, like the famous dagger that killed X-Death. Should become a collector's item in later Final Fantasies. Didn't even break 2000 HP on our tankiest character. There's Ferris. This never happened. I think she learned a lot because she was bouncing around a bit. Build up, escape, steal, capture animals, observe, analyze, terrain, flirt, white level four, black five, time two, summon five, blue, brawl, caution, dash. 32 over double what Krill had. I really like blue magic, but I definitely didn't use it to its full potential. Helped us out a bunch, though. I mean, helped us level 5 death of statues. I'm sure there's all sorts of wacky shit you could have done with blue magic if you knew how everything worked. That definitely didn't happen. We wouldn't fucking hit him with a staff. I think that was Biblos. There's Lena, kept everybody alive, appreciate that. You know, we took time magic for so long we almost never used it. Tame, control, mix, hide, flirt, dance, white six, black two, time six, summon two, medicine. Yeah, we never used we never used the chemist. She learned 26. Man, she was white time. Sorry, we agreed not to say that. Time white. She was time white for the longest time, but really all we cast was fast level two. Definitely didn't leverage time magic or blue magic. I guess time magic is really just you would know which dudes you can cast Demi on. And then, I don't know. Quick was really expensive. Medio wasn't that strong compared to other stuff. There he is. Arse. I think we actually did hit X-Step with a sword at one point. Not the Excalibur, though. Gave his life. Guard, smoke, image, throw, terrain, black two, time one, cover, barrier, alert. 22. 
That didn't feel like 22. Actually, I guess it doesn't show passive, so I never saw dual wield. Krill learned the least, and she technically joined last, but she inherited everything from Gallop. I'm sure you could have had a way greasier party, but... Those four rascals managed to make it through in One Piece. Well, sorry, most of One Piece. Ours did die at the end. I can only imagine what kind of wacky shit other people could pull off. How many times did we have to fight x -Death? I think we got him on our fourth try. Not too terrible. Probably one of the trickier Final Fantasy bosses I've seen. But thank god there was that save point right next to him. Pretty good boss for that reason. Just because you can try a strategy and then the save point's right there, you don't have to run through the whole place. But that's it. The end of Final Fantasy V. I had heaps of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. I can only imagine they uh, run around on their chocobos and, I don't know, solve mysteries like the Scooby-Doo gang now that the world is safe, but... The game is over. Thanks for watching.